evening. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi. How was your day? Uh, fine. <laughs> and you and you day, teacher? You 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 sound tired. And okay. I know that you have had a, another another earthquake closer to San Salvador in the Libertad, I think. Um, I don't know, teacher. In in Avenida Cuba. Uh, no sé cómo se si cerraron la calle porque se cayó un helicóptero de la policía. <laughs> oh. Aquí en San, en San, aquí en San Jacinto. Wow. Cuba Avenue, San Jacinto. Yes. Okay. It it it, it damaged other cars or people? Um, I don't know, teacher. Mm, crash crash car in La Libertad. Uh, I don't I don't remember exactly. Uh, un camión y un carro se chocaron <laughs> fuertemente. Wow. Mm -hmm. Well, here in Panama, it's it's something very frequent. Sometimes yeah. they even turn. <laughs> mm -hmm. They give. Uh, yo normally uh, a job in, in Uber and Drive is or es horrible las calles aquí en El Salvador, la verdad. <laughs> For example, yes, it, uh, a lot of traffic jams. Yeah, everywhere. Yes, um, not. For example, for for uh, crazy people, uh, la gente maneja muy loca. Por ejemplo, hace como yes, tres you días. Have to, you have to drive defensively. <laughs> yeah. El problema es que la gente anda muy loca. Por ejemplo, hace tres días, bueno, yo entregué el carro porque lo estaba alquilando eh, aquí por uh, Super Selectos de la cima. Se me tiró un tipo y me dañó el bumper y salió yendo. Wow. Mm -hmm. And you didn't take the the, the plate. Yeah, uh, I use camera for car. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Then you have the plate. Yeah. Okay. You you uh, give me give me the 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 data if you have pictures. Give me the pictures or the video. And the I video post, picture. I will post it in Twitter. Uh, the problem is that the car is a uh, rent car. No, it no doesn't matter. Car. It doesn't matter. Eh, el problema es que por el contrato yo tenía que pagar y lo tuve que pagar. No, it's okay, but you will mm -hmm. get your money back. No, pero me da idea de, de publicar lo mejor porque hay yes, muchos casos Yes, because the, 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 the PNC, we look for the car and, and they, they, they uh, a lot of things have sold that way. Yeah. Give me the information and I will post it in Twitter. Richard, you you driving? Yes, I drive. Uh, car or motorcycle? No, if it's a motorcycle, it's right. I oh. drive. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, sorry. Uh, <laughs> I am a study uh, uh, study um for for class the driving in motorcycle actually. Uh, no sé si lo dije. You are you are learning you are learning to ride motorcycle. Yeah, yeah. Well, have you <laughs> ever ride bikes? Yes. Well, there is no problem. It's easier than riding a bike. Um, algo. <laughs> yes, it, it is easier because you don't have to pull it. Yes, it's, it's easy. It, 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 you, you, it, the, the, the motor will help you. But I, I uh, advise you, instead of getting a, a motorcycle, get a Vespa. Oh, okay, okay. The Vespa is is more uh, has it it has a better a better structure in order for you to to avoid falling. The el Vespa, problem is that the is is that the car has many many points of blindness and the people drive very crazy. And sometimes the cars are the responsible for hitting the cars. Not always the car is the responsible. No, if you are if you are riding well, it, it doesn't matter. But yeah. uh, uh, it is better. And 
I also advise you to get the best part and put aside thing like mm -hmm. the ones that they use for World War II, remember? That you have the motorcycle and a side thing that you can sit other two people? Mm, normalmente... Una unos... como, un, un como carrito que va a la par. Ah. Oh, eh, no remember. You, you, may, you may do that and you will be... Eh, Using less gasoline, and you can uh, you can uh, be with other per person instead, okay. uh, 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 or to put things there, like when you go to shopping or something, and not mm -hmm. just because it's it's it's, it's cheaper than with a car. Mm. Por ejemplo, ahora casi tengo un accidente porque un señor se metió encima. <laughs> Yes. De mis clases de manejo. It happens, but wear all, always helmet. Okay. Yeah, I use, I use uh, casco. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's start then. Remember that yesterday we started with the thought. that education okay okay now conversation it isn't shit is it this is tag questions remember for tag questions you have to use the same modal auxiliary if you are using verb to be, you have to use verb to be. If you are using should, you use should. And opposites. That, that means that if the sentence is negative, the tag question will be affirmative. If the sentence is affirmative, the tag question will be negative. And in, in Spanish, it's like when, when you say verdad, it's like uh, checking if the, the people agree with you or not, okay? Uh, ¿Entendieron ustedes lo que es el tag question? In my case, no, teacher. Vale. Eh, lo voy a explicar en español. Thanks, teacher. Cuando usted utiliza tag question, o sea, eso es como un... El tag question es como verificando, como cuando en español decimos, ¿verdad? Entonces, ese es el tag question. Entonces, ver, es como una confirmación. Ajá. Entonces, eh, si la oración está en negativa, esta es la oración. Hasta esta coma es una oración. Está en negativa porque dice isn't. Entonces, la tag question va después de la coma. Y si esta es una, pre, una negativa, la tag question va en afirmativa. Entonces se dice, is it? Y si esta hubiese sido afirmativa, entonces la tag question hubiese sido negativa. Digamos, si esta hubiera dicho, eh, esto es conversation, o sea que esto es un diálogo. But it isn't ship. Esta es la oración. It isn't ship. Si esto hubiera dicho, it is cheap or it is expensive, para que se mantenga la misma. It is expensive, isn't it? ¿Verdad? Isn't it? Aquí sería el negativo. Pero como este está en negativo, entonces aquí es afirmativo. O sea, siempre eh, van a ir opuestos. El tag question va opuesto. Hoy sí, ¿entendieron? Vale. Con respecto al modo al auxiliar. El verbo to be, acuérdese que no necesita de auxiliar. Es auxiliar para sí mismo. 
Entonces, si va a usar el verbo to be, se deja tal cual. Si usted va a ocupar eh, cualquier otro, will, may, might, eh, ought, eh, should, must, eh, well, have, o cuando va el verbo en su forma simple, entonces usted va a ocupar do o does como está puesto. ¿Verdad? Porque el, cuando usted solo ocupa un verbo tal cual y no lleva este auxiliar, entonces lo que va a ocupar es el auxiliar do o das si es en, en presente y did si es en negativo. ¿Verdad? Para hacer el tag question. Entonces, aquí vamos a revisar en la conversación cuáles son las tag questions que salen y después vamos a ver otros ejemplos. Now, uh, follow the conversation. Health insurance, shelter bills, rent. Now, I am going to school and only working part-time. I have a hard time making ends meet. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? Si se fijan aquí va al revés, lo que yo les decía. Is really expensive, isn't it? Y aquí dice, it isn't cheap, is it? ¿Se dan cuenta? Aquí afirmativo, aquí negativo. Aquí negativo, aquí afirmativo. Ah. Yeah, my company used to pay for it when I was working full time. And child care isn't cheap, is it? No, it's not. After I pay for rent and groceries, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. Colleges should provide free daycare for students with children. I think so too, but they don't have any services like that at my school. Oh, listen to me. I'm always complaining, aren't I? But yo sé que ustedes me van a decir que no debería de decirse aren, porque lo que debería de usarse es am. Pero en el caso de am, este, en el caso de, de, de el tag question, así se utiliza cuando se está ocupando este, en forma negativa. O sea, es como una exception to the rule. ¿Ok? Entonces, aren't I? Anyway, how are the things with you? Oh, not bad, but I'm still not sure on what I'm going to do after I graduated. Yeah, it's hard to find a job these days, isn't it? Dice, este verbo to be, it's hard. Isn't it? It's not that. I'm just not sure if going to law school is the right thing to do. What do you mean? I only have a few more months before I graduate. And now I am wondering why I did this. I don't want to be a lawyer and all seems like I waste like a waste of time now. So, what are you going to do? Well, I'd like to move to Mexico and open a coffee shop, but I think my parents will flip. Okay. Hasta que terminó de estudiar, se dio cuenta de que de que eh, eh, la, las leyes no eran su carrera, dio cual. Y se quiere ir a abrir un café. Eso lo hubiera abierto desde que salió de bachiller. <risa> y si hubiera ahorrado todo lo que gastó en la universidad y todo lo que, porque para, 
para derechos se gasta un montonazo en libros. Todos los códigos que hay que comprar, de acuerdo. Y todo lo que hay que leer. I know because I study it. Ok, now repeat after me. Health insurance. Health insurance. Child care bills. Child care bills. Child care bills. Rent. 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 Now that I'm going to school. Now that I'm going to school. I'm going to school. And only working part time. And, and only working work part, -time. part time. I have a hard time making ends meet. I have a hard time. I have a hard time. Me, esta es como una expresión esta es una expresión idiomática eh, si uno lo va a traducir palabra por palabra casi que no tiene sentido pero lo que significa es que tiene un, eh, eh, o sea, le es difícil llegar al final de mes o sea, con lo que gana y con lo que gasta le es difícil llegar a, a fin de mes o sea, si se fijan, no dice ni de, nada de mes, ni nada por el estilo, pero eso es lo que significa. ¿Ok? Now, health insurance. Health insurance. Health insurance. Is really expensive, isn't it? It's really expensive, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. My yeah. company used to pay for it. My, My company, company used, used to, to pay, pay for, it. for it. When I was working full time. Full time. When, when I was, I was working, working full time. Full -time. And child care is in shape, is it? Child care is in shape, is it? Child care is in shape, is it? No, it's not. No, no, it's not. 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 After I pay for rent and groceries. After, after I pay after for I rent and groceries. Shop. Almost all my money goes to pay. <laughs> almost all my money goes to pay. For my son's daycare. For my son's daycare. Polishes. <clears throat> should provide free daycare for students with children. Colleagues should provide free daycare for students with children. I think so, too. I, I think, think so, so too. too. But they too. don't have any services like that at my school. But they, don't, so. have they don't have any services like that at my school. That might make sense. Good. Oh, listen to me. I'm always complaining, aren't I? Oh, oh listen to me. Oh, listen to me. I always I complain. complain. I need. Aren't I? <laughs> Diga, I Excuse Diga. me. Um, how do you traduce? Uh, I'm always complaining. Aren't it? Aren't I? Aren't I? Uh -huh. Siempre me, siempre me estoy, este, Cando. lamentando, lamentando uh -huh. o quejando, ¿verdad? Ah, uh, verdad, ok. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Acuérdense que yo les dije que la stack question es como buscando, buscando una verificación. Uh -huh. eh, sí. Yo sé que eh, lo que le estoy diciendo aquí, literalmente no dice así. ¿Verdad? Pero tampoco deberíamos de estar ocupando art con I. Uh -huh. Pero tampoco is, son, tampoco is. son exceptions to the rule. ¿Verdad? Tampoco is, ¿verdad? Eh, is is en, de qué? Is en, eh, is pa, para para okay. cuando está ocupando I. Uh -huh. eh, normalmente cuando se sustituye el am para el I, se hace okay. con are, okay. no, con, no con is. Okay. ¿Por qué no lo sé? ¿Por qué no lo sé? Ok. Anyway, how are the things with you? 
Anyway, how are you? Anyway, how are you doing, Pichu? Perdón. Anyway, how are the things with you? Ajá. Uh -huh. Oh, not bad. Oh, not bad. Oh, not bad. But I'm still not sure. But I'm still not but sure. I'm still not sure. On what I'm going to do after I graduated. Mm. On, on what, what I'm going to do after I graduated. I'm going to do after I graduated. Yeah, it's hard to find a job these days. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah, it's hard to find a job this isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? It's not that. It's not that. It's not that. I'm just not sure. I'm, I'm not just not sure. If going to law school is the right thing to do. If going to law school is the right thing to do. What do you mean? What, what do you mean? mean? I only have few more months before I graduate. I, I only have a few more, more before, I graduate. before I graduate. And now I'm wondering why. And now I'm wondering why. And now I'm wondering why. I did, I did this. this. I did I this. Did I, did this. Did. I did this. I don't want to be a lawyer. I don't want I don't to want to be a lawyer. And all seems like a waste of time now. And all seems like, like a waste of time, time now. now. O sea, una pérdida de tiempo. No solo pérdida de tiempo, también de dinero. Okay. That is the better career. Perdón? That is the better career. I am a lawyer. Oh, yes. Nice. Yes. I, I I am about to because I studied three years uh, to become a lawyer. But uh, I left it aside in order to help my ex to get his career and to pay for his career and all that. And mm. after after a while I say it would be much better if I finish rather than help him because mm -hmm. uh, well I even made his thesis and he didn't present it so he yeah. didn't he didn't complete he didn't uh -huh. get the he didn't get the degree because uh -huh. he 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 didn't present the thesis but that's life okay mm. but i hope that one day i could finish the the law school because i really like it i i like to read and, Please. and that's what you need the most to read and you, should, to read you well. should continue teacher yes i i wish i i wish i could <laughs> Because Gone. I I think that I, I, I will continue soon. Gone. The problem the problem was that when when we were on, on pandemic time, mm -hmm. I I get in contact with Uma. Uh, no. Yes, Uma, Un Universidad Modular Abierta. Yes. Because there I was studying. And I asked her them to put the career online and to let me get in but they never replied to me and later i found out that they do that but they didn't say you can get in mm -hmm. so i missed the opportunity now why is it more easy teacher because you can study online but uh uh, are they still with the career in online? I think so. Well, I even will try to even you US. <laughs> because I want to continue with the same university. 
because when you change university, it is more expensive and you don't get all the, the stuff that you already have. You lose some, maybe. Maybe. And here in Panama, I cannot study to become a lawyer because I am a, in Panama. Uh, I am a yeah. I live here in Panama, but there are mm -hmm. there are careers that are forbidden for foreigners. For example, my brother is an engineer, but he cannot say that he is an engineer here because it is forbidden for uh, foreigners to be to be engineers here but remember that it's not the same that if you study in panama if that if you study in el salvador yes i know i know it's not the same i had to start again about the the our around laws yes but uh, that's why okay. i am uh, trying to make that all the region get together and then all the people can go and study anywhere and that your your career can be developed at any country in in in, in the region por eso quiero que se una la la, la centroamérica y el caribe <laughs> it, 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 it is much better for the people it is much better for the people to become united. Yes, it will be much better. Well, well, I'd like to move to Mexico. Well, I'd like to move to Mexico. And open a coffee shop. And open a coffee shop. But I think my parents will flip. But I I think my parents will flip. It. But me will flip. Se que se van a a a enojar o que se van a desmayar que se van. Ah. Okay. Todavía lo piensa. I'm sure. <laughs> okay. Now. Uh, what time is it? Well, we will uh, do the conversation, but first I want to check on the on the on the other tag questions. So we will return to the to the practice of the conversation later. Okay, here said tag questions for opinions, affirmative statement plus negative tag, okay? Now repeat after me. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? Health insurance, Health is, insurance really is really expensive. expensive. There are lots of criminals in the city, aren't there? There are lots there of criminals there are in the city, city. Are in the city. aren't there? Graffiti makes everything look ugly. Graffiti makes everything look ugly. ugly. Doesn't huh? it? Doesn't it? Si se fijan, aquí estamos ocupando ver to be is, porque esta es como singular. Este es plural, entonces ocupa are. Y aquí dice, isn't it? Porque este health insurance lo toman como it. Entonces, isn't it. Aquí, there are lots of criminals. Aren't there? Pero aquí dice there. ¿Sí? Pero en este caso aquí dice graffiti makes. Aquí, si se fijan en, en, en esta oración, no hay auxiliar. ¿Por qué? Porque está afirmativo, presente simple. Entonces, pero este makes ocupa el auxiliar does not, o sea, doesn't, ¿verdad? Y el graffiti se, se eh, cambia por it. Entonces, doesn't it. 
si aquí este hubiese sido negativo, entonces hubiera dicho, graffiti does not make everything look beautiful, que es lo opuesto a, a ugly. Entonces aquí diría, does it, ¿verdad? Pero aquí doesn't, sería doesn't aquí. Pero como este era en afirmativo, se quedó en afirmativo y el que va a ir en negativo es el tag, el tag puesto. Y acuérdense que siempre va una coma antes del tag puesto. Ok. Now, colleges should provide daycare, shouldn't they? Colleges should provide daycare, shouldn't they? Ok. Colleges. Eh, lo toman como tercera persona del plural, entonces sería they, colleges. Los eh, colegios, en este caso, colegios se refieren a universidades, pero que son así como que dan técnicos, ¿verdad? O sea, las universidades son las que ofrecen carreras de más, de, de cinco años o más. Y en cambio, los colleges son los que ofrecen carreras técnicas de dos o tres años. O sea, esa es, esa es la diferencia entre una universidad y un college, ¿verdad? En Estados Unidos. No. Eh, ahora dice, negative statement plus affirmative chat. Lo que yo les decía. Cuando la oración es afirmativa, el tag question va en negativa. Cuando la oración es negativa, el tag question va en afirmativo. Bueno, repeat after me. Child care isn't cheap. Child care isn't cheap. There aren't enough police. Are there? There aren't enough police. Are there? People don't care about our city. People don't care about our city. Do they? Do they? You can't find affordable childcare, can you? You can't find affordable childcare, can you? Can you? ¿Tienen alguna duda o consulta con respecto a vocabulario aquí? Affordable, teacher. Affordable, eh, que sea fácil de pagar. O sea, que ah, sea, okay. que esté a, a su alcance de pagar. Okay. Affordable. Okay. Mm -hmm. Entonces, fijémonos. Aquí, isn't, isn't cheap. Is it? Aren't, aren't, are there? People don't care. Do they? You can't find. Can you? Entonces, si se fijan, verbo to be, verbo to be. <coughs> verbo to be, verbo to be. Eh, auxiliar to, do. Auxiliar can, can. O sea, siempre hay que respetar lo que se está utilizando en la oración. Y acuérdense que cuando no traiga, como en este caso, que no, tra no traía este auxiliar, entonces nos fijamos que era una oración afirmativa, presente simple. Entonces, como eh, era para tercera persona porque era makes, entonces iba a auxiliar, el auxiliar iba a ser das. Teacher, dígame. Uh, in the second one, uh -huh. why we do, why don't you use they? Podía ser they. Mm. Pero en este caso, como decía, there are, o sea, hay. But there is for there are, o sea, hay. Uh -huh, hay muchos hay. criminales en la ciudad, uh -huh. pero no podría decir. Eh, eh, podía ser de y eh, podía ser de pero en este ah, caso okay. que esta era como que ah, hay verdad ahí hay verdad uh -huh. verdad entonces pero podía ser de y también 
ser. Okay. Podría ser sí, they sí, sí. usando, eh, there are lots, usando como lots of criminals, aquí. Entonces, aren't they? Pero en este caso, uh -huh. aren't they? Porque está diciendo de que allí hay. Uh -huh. ¿Verdad? Ok. Thank you, teacher. Ok. Bien, entonces alguien decía por ahí que no le había quedado muy claro lo que era la stack question. ¿Cómo está ahorita? ¿Lo entiende un poco mejor? Un poco Hello. mejor, dicho. Ya mejor. Excelente. ¿Se dan cuenta por qué? A pesar de haber terminado la plataforma, siempre necesitamos venir a la clase. Porque estas duditas así se van sacando en lo que es este la clase. Bien, ahí después dice, when to use stack questions. O sea, cuando las utilizamos. When we expect someone to agree with us. Or when we are asking for confirmation. O sea, cuando estamos esperando que alguien esté de acuerdo con nosotros o cuando estamos pidiendo una confirmación. ¿verdad? Entonces ocupamos lo que es las tag questions. Entonces, ¿cómo trabajan las tag questions? ¿Verdad? When a statement is affirmative, the tag question is negative. Eh, for example, learning English is easier. Isn't it? Entonces, si se fijan, aquí les he puesto que está afirmativo y el tag question va en negativo. Después aquí dice, when a statement is negative, the tag question is affirmative. Child care isn't cheap, is it? Y después dice, when B is the main verb, B is also used in the tag question. For example, they are arriving on time, aren't they? He isn't an engineer, is he? When you, we use the same model in the main clause and the tag. For example, we should pay our taxes, shouldn't we? He could call her. He couldn't call her, could he? Entonces, si se fijan, should, shouldn't, couldn't, could. ¿Verdad? Por, en eso fue que tuvieron varios problemas a la hora de hacer sus ejercicios. Que querían usar el verbo to be para el tag question siempre. Y lo tenían que usar según el modal auxiliary que se esté ocupando en la oración. A simple present and past. They use the auxiliary verb in the tag. Aquí estaba. Este era afirmativo, presente simple. Y este era found, perdón. Aquí found, esta es una D. O sea, que es el pasado de find. Entonces, aquí como este era presente, se ocupa does. Este como es pasado, se ocupa didn't. ¿verdad? Tenemos que fijarnos en eso, en el, en el, en la tense del, del verbo, para de acuerdo a eso, utilizar el, el auxiliar en el tag questions. Entonces, ahora nos vamos a ir, este, a hacer el, Vamos a ir a hacer el ejercicio. Acuérdense que hoy vamos a adelantar lo más que podamos porque pretendo terminar con ustedes el examen mañana, que sería miércoles, para dejar el jueves para que hagan lo de las presentaciones, lo que le hicieron falta. O también, este, si... Si no, si no hacen el resto que les hacían falta las presentaciones, tengo las reading para que las practiquemos otra vez así, 
de ir leyendo uno detrás del otro y hacer ejercicios de preguntas. Bien, o sea, la idea es que usted practique un poquito más. Now, add tag questions to these statements. Remember, if the statement is affirmative, the tag question must be negative or vice versa. Just type the tag question. No capital letters or periods are needed. Now, here, you can't escape advertising nowadays. ¿Cómo iría aquí? ¿Cómo iría el número uno? El tag question. Calladitos. Can you? Can you? Excelente. Vale, ¿Por qué? Porque aquí eh, el, el, el pronombre personal es you y está ocupando can't, que es el negativo de can. Entonces aquí el tag question tiene que ir en afirmativo. Okay. Now, uh, number two, somebody to read it, please. There aren't enough gun control laws. Are there? Are there? Okay. Now, number three. Noise pollution is a major problem here, isn't it? Okay, someone else? Number four? Debbie Segura? Could you help us? There are more, yeah. There are more and more homeless people on the streets, aren't there? Okay, thank you. Now, Janira. Janira Mendoza. Hello, hello. Tiene que quitarse el mute. Ok. Excuse me, teacher. Ajá, number five. ¿Cómo quedaría? Hola. Eh, Hola. The sales tax should be... Um, the sales tax should be lowered. Shouldn't, shouldn't, uh -huh. shouldn't, shouldn't it? Eh, no, no sería it porque dice the sales. Ah, sí, sí, sería it That's porque it. no no dice taxes, dice tax. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Now number six, Francisco Alberto. Okay, teacher. It is in it is. Is the same money these days? Is it? Excellent. Thank you. Now. ¿Cómo se pronuncia la siguiente picture? Downsizing o cómo se pronuncia? Downsizing. Sizing. Down, downsizing. Downsizing. Okay. Uh -huh. eh, Ros Rosemary Samar. Downsizing is hurting the, the economy. The economy. Mm -hmm. The economy is an it. Thank you. Uh, Jose Eraide. Jose Eraide. 
Good evening. Could you help us with number eight, please? Se me salió. Uh, Jenny Elizabeth, could you help us with number eight? Okay, teacher. Um, the city doesn't do enough for the straight animals. That's it. Thank you. Entonces hoy lo vamos a revisar. Yes, miren, lo hicieron bien. Okay. And now let's continue. Well, I guess that now we can return to the dialogue. And practice it. Hi, teacher. Yes. I'm sorry that I was connected with my, uh, Cell phone. I don't know, uh, no, with my, how do you say parlante? Speaker. Speaker, in order to listen better. But I didn't realize that when I'm doing that, I cannot stop. Uh -huh, okay. I cannot talk, so I was trying to, to disconnectar on link <laughs> the speaker don't worry but, well. don't worry don't worry okay but now you will you will talk okay okay now, i need two volunteers for this conversation well i'm one of them teacher okay mm -hmm. you you go first who second me, teacher quien va después me, teacher. Okay, Alejandro, go ahead. Okay. Who is our teacher? You. You are the first. Okay. Health insurance, child care bills, rent. Now that I am going to school and only working part time, I have a hard time making ends meet. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? Yeah, my company used to pay for it when I was working full time. And childcare isn't cheap, is it? No, it's not. After I pay for rent and groceries, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. Colleges should provide free daycare for students with children. I think so too, but they don't have any services like that at my school. Oh, listen to me. I'm always complaining, aren't I? Anyway, how are the things with you? Oh, not bad, but I'm still not sure on what I'm going to do after I graduate. Yeah, it's hard to find a a job this day, isn't it? It's not that. I'm just not sure if going to to love school is the right thing to do. What do you mean? I only have a few more months before I graduate and now I'm wondering why I did this. I don't want to be a lawyer and all seems like I watched uh, of time now. Waste. 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 So, what are you going to do? Well, I like to move to Mexico and open open a coffee shop, but I think my parents will flip. <laughs> he thinks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Poor parents. <laughs> uh, that's why. When I was uh, giving classes at, at university, normally I gave classes in the first, first, uh, 
subjects uh, in, in uh, at any career, and I always told them, study something that you really love to do, not just yes. because you want to have a, a good pay job or because uh, you are following someone's advice. You have to choose something that you look, love to do and that you can even do it without getting any pay. And that way, you will be happy with yourself and you won't feel underpaid in, 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 at any time and you will be happier and healthier because most of the people that uh, only go to a career and then go to a job without loving what you are doing, uh, you become uh, like uh, not happy, okay? Uh, sad or angry or whatever. And, and then that affects you in your health, okay? And then, and you you are miserable and you are making miserable the people around you. And that's not good. You have to do what you love to do, okay? And that's always. For example, right now, I, I am not working, but my two, my two older sons and my brother live in another house. And I am going, to their house to make their breakfast so they can start the day with breakfast because I love to cook. And they feel that my my omelets or whatever I do for them is the most delicious of all because I do what I love to do, okay? And that's why I can cook well because I put love in the cooking <laughs> and it, it i am not i am not a chef but i love what i'm doing okay so the same to to anything that you do in your life do it if you like to do it if you don't like to do it and you can skip it skip it because otherwise you will be or angry all the time or sad or you will feel miserable and that's not good, okay? Now, other two volunteers? May I miss? Okay, who else? Me teacher. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Hill insurance, child care bill rent now that that I'm going to school and only working part time, I have a hard time making ends meet. Health insurance is really expensive, is it? It isn't it? Yeah, my... isn't it? Isn't, isn't it? it? Uh -huh. Isn't it? Yeah, my company used to pay for it when I was working full time. And child care isn't cheap, easy. Wait. Uh -huh. No, it's not. After I pay for, for rent and groceries, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. College tour provide three day care for a student with children. I think so too, but they don't have any services like that at my school. Oh, listen, it's my name. Uh huh. It's 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 your. Go ahead. Continue. Okay. ¿Quién era ese? El último que termina aquí tiene que empezar aquí. 
Oh, okay. Uh, it's me. Mm -hmm. Oh, listen to me. I'm always complaining, aren't I? Anyway, how are the things with you? Oh, not bad. But I still not sure of what I am going to do after I graduated. Yeah, it's hard to find a job these days, isn't it? It's not that. I am just not sure it's going to launch a school is the right thing to do. What do you mean? I only had a few more months before I graduate. And now I am wondering why I did this. I don't want to be a lawyer and all seem like a waste of time now. Like a waste of time now. ¿Qué pasó? Mi teacher. Sí, like, eh, o sea, tiene que terminar. Like mm -hmm. a waste of time oh. now. Ok, es que cayó una llamada. Excuse me. Ah. I don't want to be a lawyer and all seem like a waste of time now. Ok, thank you. So, what are you going to do? Well, I like to move to Mexico and open a coffee shop, but I think my parents will flip. Okay, thank you very much. What happened, Alejandro? I don't know anything, teacher. I don't know. Um, I'm sorry, teacher. <laughs> okay, don't worry. Okay, other two volunteers? Jenny? Who else? Me, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Uh, health insurance, child, child care with rent now. <laughs> Perdón. Health insurance, child care bill. Rent now that I'm going to school and only working part time. I have a hard time making ends meet. Okay. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? Yeah, my company used to pay for it when I was working full time. And child care isn't cheap, is it? No, it's not. After I pay for rent and groceries, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. College should provide free daycare for students with children. I think so, but I, I think so too, but they don't have any services like that at my school. You continue. Oh, Jenny. Oh, listen Jenny. to me. Uh -huh. oh, listen to me. I always complaining, aren't I? Anyway, how are the things with you? Uh, oh, not bad, but I'm still not sure on what I'm going to do after I graduated. Yeah, it's hard to find a job these days, isn't it? Uh -huh. It's not that. I'm just not sure if going to law school is the right thing 
seen the truth. What do you mean? I only have a few more months before I graduate. And now I am wondering why I did this. I don't want to be a lawyer. And all seems like a waste of time now. So what are you going to do? Well, <laughs> I like to move to Mexico and open a coffee shop, but I think my parents will flip. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. Great. Okay. Now let's see. A ver, a ver. ¿Qué se me hizo el, el de compartir? Pregunta. Que no, no se baja esta cosa. Permita. No me quiere dejar compartir. Ah, hoy sí. A ver. Este, vamos a hacer el, este reading exercise. A ver. Um. Pero vamos a ver primero esta. Ah, okay. Be the change you want to see in the world. Cortito, pero profundo, ¿verdad? Sé el cambio que quieres ver en el mundo. O sea, muchas veces nosotros nos quejamos y estamos como diciendo, esto no sirve, esto no sirve, aquello tampoco, pero nosotros tampoco no, no hacemos lo que deberíamos de hacer para hacer los cambios. Entonces, no es solamente señalar qué es lo que hay que cambiar, sino que hay que demostrar cómo se hacen los cambios. ¿Ok? Entonces, eh, el, este es con la intonation. Permítanme. Vamos a trabajar la entonación. ¿Ok? Listen. Listen and practice. Use following intonation in talk questions when you're giving an opinion and want to know if the other person agrees. Intonation in tag questions. Part A. Listen and practice. Use following intonation in tag questions when you are giving an opinion and want to know if the other person agrees. Ethnic conflict is a terrible problem, isn't it? They should make guns illegal, shouldn't they? Before we go, we want to remind you that you may play the audio programs, explanations, and videos as many times as you need to. It is always a good idea to practice with your friends. Listen and practice. Okay. It's always a falling intonation. Okay. Ethnic conflict is a terrible problem isn't it isn't it they should make guns illegal shouldn't they shouldn't they is falling intonation isn't it shouldn't they falling intonation 
sea, con los tag questions es falling intonation. Ok. Eh, any, any doubts about that? No. Okay. We finish with the eh, with the lesson. We almost finish. Solo falta lo que es el reading. Tomorrow we will be doing the reading and we will developing the final test. And with that, we finish. If you are ready with your presentations, you can do it uh, on Thursday. And if you are not prepared, we can continue with the readings of uh, the whole course. O sea, los, los, las, las lecturas de todo el curso. Las vamos a volver a hacer, sí, leyendo uno detrás del otro. Para que practiquemos, ¿verdad? Entonces, see you tomorrow. See Take you tomorrow. good care. And if you have any doubts about anything that we have covered during, during the, uh, the course, you may ask to, uh, tomorrow and the day after tomorrow. Bye bye. Good teacher. Thank good you, night. Teacher. Bye. 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 B